I don't know if you know this, but Hosting Group has a free WordPress plugin for Amazon affiliates. That means that you can bring in products with your affiliate link and it's going to create a table for you for free. So let's go check this out right now. What's up, everyone? So Hostinger is making it really easy for you to bring your Amazon affiliate links with a nice looking table on your WordPress site. The WordPress plugin is completely free and it's from Hostinger. Now, if you want to check it out, link we provided in the description. Now, to access that WordPress plugin is also easy. So in your H panel, go to websites and this is available for the WordPress sites. So do consider that. In this case, I'm going to show you with this one, ltdsell.shop, and I'm going to go to my dashboard for that particular website. I'm going to go to WordPress overview and an overview we're going to scroll down here and we're going to find suggested plugins go ahead and install it once you do that it's going to be available inside of your wordpress dashboard in this case you're going to find it right here so go to hostinger and you're going to find amazon affiliate the first thing we need to do is obviously connect our amazon account with this plugin now before i show you how to connect it let me show you their affordable plans that they have for wordpress so go to the link in the description, go to WordPress, go to, for example, manage WordPress. And in WordPress, we're going to find the deals that they have available right now. But there's an extra discount coupon code that I want to show you how to apply it. So, for example, let's use this was as an example, the most popular one. And in this case, it's going to ask you first, how many months do you want to pay in advance? I always recommend 48 months because you lock in the lowest price, lowest renewal price, and you're good to go for 48 months. All right. And down here where it says have a coupon code, go ahead and apply my coupon code, which is SAS Master, and the price is going to drop to $172 with 37 cents. Remember, that's for 48 months. So that's pretty affordable, right? Now, let me show you how this actually works and how to set it up. All right. So go to settings and in settings, we need to connect our API key from Amazon. Now, don't worry. It's super easy to do this. Okay. So let's go to our dashboard right here. Here we go. It's going to take us directly to this section. Now, if you're not logged in, go ahead and log in first and it'll take you directly to this section. Now, we're going to need access to our API. Let me go ahead and delete this one that I've just created for demo purposes. And I'm going to create a new credential. Here we go. We got our access key. We're going to paste that here. We're going to grab our secret key, which is not so secret anymore. The country, in this case, my Amazon account is from US, but you have available all the Amazon uh, countries available here. And the tracking ID is going to be your name right here, the store name that you use. So let me go ahead and copy this. Here we go. Tracking ID, save changes, and we are now connected. Tell me that wasn't easy. All right. So let's go ahead and go back and we have our settings set up. We're going to go to table data collection. All right. So let's add a new table. In this case, I'm going to name this table, for example, I don't know, DJI. And that's because that's what I'm going to compare on this website. And I have the option to search by ASI in N. ASIN or search by product. So either way, super easy to do. So I'm going to search by product and I'm just going to search DJI really quickly and I'm going to select the products that I want to compare. So for example, if I want to compare these three drones, all right, let's do this three drones. You can select as many as you want. Go ahead and confirm selection. And then we have a few settings here. For example, here's the ASIN ID that you can use later on if you need to do it manually. Then we have the added highlight. So for example, if I want to highlight this one, I'll say I'll use like a greenish and the label is going to be best choice. All right. And I'm not going to do so. I could, for example, say second choice and third choice. It's optional. You don't have to add anything there, but if you like so, it's there. And you also have the option to add more products here. Let's go ahead and continue. And then we can tie our variables. So the name of the title will say title and I would say, for example, in this case, brand instead of title and the enter name thumbnail, I'll leave it as it is, or I'll just say image, the price and Amazon button. All right. And I can add new roles and titles variables. In this case, I'm going to save changes. Here we go. I, I am going to receive a short code, which I'm going to copy. And if I want to add more tables, I can do so here to make several comparison of Amazon products with this. OK, so let's go into a page. I am going to add a new page and I'll just say test and I'm going to add here short code and I'm going to add my short code. I'm going to publish it. Go ahead and publish. And we're going to go ahead and view this page and boom, we have our table right here. And if they click on this button, it's going to count as a cell for us because it has our affiliate link. So you don't have to tweak anything else once that's done. Now you can see this is the highlighted one and I've named this the best choice. This is the second choice and this is the third choice. Now, like I said, this option is optional. You don't have to add that if you don't want. 
and you can see the brand i can say product in this case that's image price and amazon button here so it's super easy to do this now there's no indication that it says hosting girl or branding or anything like that it's white labeled so you don't have to worry about branding with this okay so it's completely white label now that's how easy it is to connect your amazon affiliate plugin from hosting girl. so do take advantage of it like i said this is free just go ahead and add and install it right here and go ahead through the setup process like i showed you right now and you're good to go so that's how you're going to add your wordpress plugin for amazon affiliate from hostinger and that's a wrap for this video